Hi, I'm Marna, and a couple weeks ago we went to some garage sales, and I thought I'd show you what we got. Um, it was kind of a heyday for fabric. Isn't that cute? There's, uh, I don't know how much here, but there is enough for doll clothes, that's for sure. And that is a good size print. And they had, look at that, there's at least, of course that might be cut up. We'll see. Let's take a look. See what we got here. Yeah, she was doing some quilting, but even if that's cut into strips, that's cut into strips for some skirts and items for dolls. That's a that's a real good size for the BJDs and the 28-inch Barbies. Uh, who knows what else? And then she had this. Oh, how cute is that for Christmas? And this is a whole piece. Those little uh, candy canes. Uh, that was a jackpot. I think I paid... I don't know, maybe a dollar each for those, not sure. And she had this, this is a, like a jackpot. Let me open this, oh, she's got it stapled shut. I don't know why, it's a Ziploc, but okay. They, this is really cute. Oh, there's some smaller there too, ooh, matching. Jackpot, oh, three different sizes. Well, let me show you what that'll do. So if you have a Blythe, or a Barbie, this will make a really cute skirt, especially over uh, if you had this color fabric and you made a tighter skirt underneath and then made a, a little uh, over skirt out of that. This you could actually layer if you wanted to. Um, that would be really cute. Anyway, I paid like 50 cents for this and I, what I saw was skirts, easy to make, Cute on the doll and fun. And then this was really the, the prize of this garage sale. Skater Barbie in excellent condition. I mean, beautiful condition. Look at the hair. But the skates, I don't know if you're an eBay shopper and you've looked for this stuff. My, oh my, these skates are hard to find and not inexpensive. I got her for $1, and I'm leaving her just like this for display. I thought she was really pretty and so worth the money. Oh, I got a couple really fun things here. These are Thanksgiving and Christmas um, they go over like a bottle of alcohol that you would take to your um, host. Um, and they make them so that they sit on top of the alcohol bottle. I think and that's going to be a, a silly, whimsical little hat. These sweaters, if you find these, don't be discouraged. They have these, the, the very top stitching of these sweaters is very tightly wove. It is not a stretch um, like yarn. It doesn't stretch like that. So what I'm going to do in another video is show you how to clip that so you can get that over your doll's uh, thighs or head so that your dolls could wear this, what do they call them, ugly sweaters? I think that's really cute. Anyway, I paid like, I don't know, maybe a quarter 10 cents, I think. Seems to ring a bell. I bought these. I thought they were really cute. They are a good size for the American Girl Christmas tree. 25 cents. And I said it. I've got a Blythe dot. And I found, I don't know if you can see this. I'm trying to get it out without tearing up the packaging. But I guess it doesn't matter. Um... I found this little keychain backpack. It's a coin purse. Um, and I'm going to put straps on that for one of the Blyce. It would also be cute for Barbie or Skipper. Uh, really cute. I really did pay oh, 50 cents for that. Cheap enough. Um, I love Sunny Day. I thought she was a cute doll when I saw her on the shelf. This one is in pretty good shape. I have another one. She's a little faded. She does have her shoes and dress like this one, but she's a little faded. I just think these are cute dolls in a cute size, and I'm going to get her cleaned up. I think I paid a quarter for her. 
Um, and I'm always looking for 4th of July <clears throat> holiday decorations. I, I put out pretty big for the 4th of July. I'm very proud of our country and the independence and freedoms we have. Um, oh, I found earrings. When I find those at garage sales or thrift stores for a 50 cents or less, I buy them because you don't know what doll you might want to put those on. I looked all over for this. We bought this cowbell before my son's mountain bike race, and I meant to take that there, but we got to the race and Darren says, where's the bell? And I said, oh, I don't know. Here is a little troll I got. I don't know. I, I probably got it thrown in with a deal. Um, and then I bought these little socks. If you look for these at garage sales, you can find them a lot of times, especially in baby and toddler size. For 10 cents, 25 cents, 50 cents, I don't pay a dollar. I can get them for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. But I got these for 10 cents. I thought they'd make some cute clothes for some dolls. That would be her size, which would be good. And that was kind of fun. This was kind of a prize. It is red fishnet stockings. I cut these up and make fishnets for my dolls. And you can get them for several dolls if you sew them correctly. And you'll want to do that by hand. If you sew them correctly, you can get several dolls uh, fishnets out of one pair, depending on the size of the doll. And then I got some miscellaneous jewelry. I got these for the beads. Um, I don't really like that, but someone would. And these are earrings. I kind of like them, but I just don't wear earrings like that anymore. I kind of have my hoops on and leave my hoops on, but how cute would that be on a um, Kaya doll, the American Indian doll, with, if you made her a, an outfit to look like deer skin and used dark navy um, beads and highlights in it. I just thought that was pretty cool. I think those would fit her, that's why I bought them. This is just a chain. And these I got for 10 cents. Not going to leave them. They're hearts. I'll need those for Valentine's for my dolls. And I found this little perfume. I, I love perfume cologne. I wear it every single day. I learned as a teenager, if you have greasy hair, spritz your part or the top of your head with cologne and the alcohol will keep the grease at bay. I paid 10 cents. This is perfume, perfume. And um, I wish they would have had, I don't know, 30, 40, 100 bottles of this. The last thing I got, I don't know how it's going to work or if it will work, but I love this. I'm going to try to set this up on my bicycle for my Yorkshire Terrier to ride in. She has a basket and it zips shut and all that, but I just thought this was really cute and I got it for a dollar. So that's what I got. I had a fun time and found a few things and I thought you might wanna see them. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe.